All right, here's the Vox Grand Prix for sale on Reverb. I'm going to uh, start out with the effects. Here's the E-tuner. You can tell it's out of, temp, out of tune, but what are you gonna do? Uh, here's the treble bass booster. Here it is on bass. Here's the fuzz. Through the treble bass booster. Here's the repeater. I'm gonna put a little distortion on it just to drive it a little bit harder. Here's with no effects, uh, except for drive. I'm going to just take you through the pickups. This is the neck. Here's the bridge. both at the same time. Uh, here's with a little bit of treble bass boost. Neck again. Uh, here's back of the neck. Here's with fuzz and a little bit of drive. fuzz and the treble fuzz.
it's got a really low, slick action. I could take a chord. <laughs> And it's got enough sustain that the the chords just ring. It's crazy. <clears throat> now, a couple things to know about this guitar. Oh, first the uh, the wad is disengaged, but also these cracks that you normally get on old Vox guitars started but then they were sealed. So you can still see where there was finished flaws, but they've been sealed in with lacquer. So they should be completely solid for, you know, 50, another 50 years or something. Uh, you can still see some of the cracks, like you can still see the impressions, but they're completely stabilized and filled in. <coughs> Um, what else? You got a couple extra holes right here, but they're filled in as well. Um, you can see some of those finished flaws. <coughs> uh, the neck is pretty good. It's got a lot of flame. Tuners all work great. Inlay is still good. It's a great, great guitar. Mm.